So, uh, 10.8. Uh, I wouldn't worry too much about that. Um, anyway, uh, what I've done now is I have my little airlift pump in the bucket. And there's a tiny drip, but I'll just show you. So the water goes straight up into this. And uh, there's a tiny, tiny leak here, which might seal itself in a few days with a uh, little biofilm or whatever of gum. Anyway, that's it's going quite fast. And then the water comes along here and in here. And the speed is slightly variable because you get an air bubble in and then the air bubble will go through like this. And uh, it'll come. The first one is still a little bit blocked up, but that's fine. The air bubbles come along. And when they get to this one here, the air will uh, bubble out and it'll speed up. And then everything flows a little quicker for a minute. And, and then this kind of jams up again with air bubbles and slows down. So that's fine. That'll mean um, everything goes all the time, slightly different speeds. And it's way more water being flown through, um, bubble through than the previous method. So, so this is it's in bits. There's a guy in Kamloops uh, on YouTube. It, it was his idea uh, to um, have uh, one sixteen, uh, one sixteen inch holes in in the uh, the thing, and just raise and lower them to get them so they're all flowing fairly evenly. So I didn't think it would w work that good but it works fine. This one here I made the hole too big so I have a little uh, piece of uh, wire in it to plug it. But a little bit more slight adjustment up and down and everything will be just fine. And see now the water level here has gone down and is plugged for the moment. There's still drips coming through though so that's good because I want the drips to come through pretty much all the time to transport heat down into the soil evenly. So it's not perfectly even drips but as long as they're coming through I'm happy. So see this one slow drip now. This one here. Maybe we have to adjust this one down a tiny tiny bit. Uh, seems to be stopped. But um, yeah so I'll just show you. If I adjust that down ever so tiny amount, it starts dripping as well. So you get them all going evenly just by adjusting them down a teeny bit. And uh, we have our four little drips going all the way along. And things should be very, very good. And this uh, going straight up with these airlift pumps is always the quickest. So you can see it's uh, pumping like crazy actually so so that's good and um, everything is dripping each one is dripping this one just dripped a moment ago so that means the heat is moving down into the soil and uh, there's a temperature it is five to four so uh, days nearly over sun wise and at this time of year in this Greenhouse, I don't get a lot of sun anyway. It's not really. I didn't expect I could start any plants this time of year, but I guess I can with this thing. Anyway, thank you. Uh, thanks to It's and Bits and Cam Loops for uh, that idea, and it works great. Thanks.